So we're continuing on with our uh, lamp build. And the next thing we've got to do is make the scrolls that are going to hold the lamp in place. There's a wire chase that I had to create within the scroll. In other words, I had to make a little indentation here so that I could fit in a piece of 1 8 inch pipe to carry the wire from the bottom of the lamp up towards the top. And what I did is I blocked up using some heavy bar plate. I welded two bars, parallel bars, such that when I drop down with my top punch, I have a piece of half inch tubing welded in and two blocks, quarter inch on both sides, so that these blocks will hit this at the end of the stroke so then I can go ahead and produce that shape. I did that first, and then I made the scroll. When I'm making scrolls, I, I'd like to hold the part if I can without the top. So here we go. I'm going to roll that right over the edge. Kind of having to walk the hammer along the width of the bar so I can get a relatively even scroll. I'm advancing the scroll and I'm hitting it kind of the same way. I'm going to flip it over. Never hitting in the same spot. I'm starting to lose the heat on the top. That's about as far as I can get because this is really cold. So I'll throw it back in the forge and just keep working it. So now I've got to do the counter bend. So I'm going to put the bending fork in here and I'll be doing this. I'm going to check this to see if I if I've got a pretty good counter bend against the, uh, the our little cardboard uh, template. I'm going to call it good. <laughs> 